Vlogmas day one. It's about 10.30, I'm just heading up to my dad's workshop. He is a mechanic. Um, I've got Joe's car today because Joe's car, the windscreen wipers have stopped working or they're like, they're working a bit intermittently. So I'm taking it up to the workshop quickly to see dad so he can figure out what's wrong. I think he might need to order a part, he said. So um, yes, heading up there now and I'll be back home straight away because I have so much to catch up on today, housework wise. So it's a very exciting day to start Vlogmas. Okay, so I'm back. In true car fashion, the wipers work perfectly fine for my dad. So we weren't able to sort of figure out what was going on. Um, we're just gonna have to monitor it and see. I'm gonna open up this package. Oh, it's from Timu, how exciting. I've actually got a, oh. I've actually got a few things from Timu lately. This is from Timu. Um, super cute, I love it. Taylor's got the blue one. And the little silicon base, which I definitely recommend if you do get something like that. And then, oh, okay. And then this is actually for the water bottle too. It's like a little bottle sling. I'll pay, unpack it in a sec. Um, and then that one is a secret. So <laughs> let's see. Oh, how cute! So. strap goes on and then you've got a little pocket for your phone <laughs> oh my gosh how cute it's like um what's the material called is it neoprene is that what you call it is that how you pronounce it and then a strap oh it even comes with like a little hook for your keys or something <gasps> but look So I got one for Taylor as well. Like I say, she's got the blue bottle. So um, yeah, I just got, I was hoping the white for her as well. But I know it's like dramatic <laughs> to have a bag just for your drink bottle, but I love it. I truly do. And then this thing, whoops it is. This thing is like a little, I don't know what these are, but it's like a little, um, what is a little stand for Taylor's oils like her um diffuser oils so imagine oh my god easiest thing i've ever put together is it gonna stay though i wonder why they were cloudy <laughs> so you get the little rings and they go over there to keep it in place, of course, of course. Ew. So that's just a little acrylic stand for her oils. I'll go put it up and show you. Her room is a mess, so there's probably not gonna be any space for me to put this at the moment, um, especially with her, uh, her Christmas decorations. So that's it there, how cute is that? It gives you an idea of the size of it as well. I thought it was going to be too big. I mean, it gives her a bit of room to have some more. I mean, he could even go over there too. How cute. Zaren Burr from Hamilton. <laughs> I'll see if I can link to those things on Timu. I've never linked to anything on Timu before, um, but I assume you can do it just like any other any other store. So I'm going to make my lunch. Um, it's like, oh, it's 12 o'clock exactly. So it's perfect timing, but oh no. I was gonna make some wraps, but now I can't do that. Um, maybe I'll run back up to the shop. That wasn't very organized of me. All right, I'm gonna run back up to the shop and grab some veggies so I can make some wraps. Look at Joe's car, he's got all these Mentos. <laughs> the postie just literally drove up to my front door on his motorbike. We've got about, I don't know, 10 meters worth of front yard um and clearly no lawn growing out the front because he just literally drove his bike rather than going to post box he just drove all the way to the front door so i'll go see what he delivered That was great timing because I literally came inside with my um, shopping and then there he was. 
I'm pretty sure I ordered a fire stick in the Black Friday sales. Um, yeah. So we've already got one in our front room here where we watch TV like as a family, but I wanted to get one for going for our bedroom. And then we've got another TV in like the games room, family room area um, where the kids hang out. So another one's coming as well, but they were only like 30 bucks in the um what i was trying to say in the prime day sale we already have apple tvs in all three of those rooms which we've had for years and years and years since we moved in here basically but you can only get i mean you can get most things on there but there's no like browser like web browser on the apple tv whereas the fire stick has a web browser i wouldn't say you need both the apple tv and the fire stick like if you don't have either of those at the moment i'd say probably go the fire stick um the apple tv is really good for um integration with you know, if you've got iPhones and Apple computers and all that kind of stuff. But at the end of the day, the Fire Stick pretty much can do that anyway. So, um, and the Fire Stick's like $150 cheaper. So definitely do that if you haven't already got one. All right, I make some lunch. So what do we have to catch up on? A year's worth of stuff, right? It is the final couple of weeks of school for the kids. Um, Taylor is finishing primary school. Um, in, if you're in America or Elko, that's it's like elementary. Ooh, it's elementary school actually, and she will be starting high school next year. Owen is finishing year two, so he's in year three next year. Um, if you're not from Australia, if you're not sure, we our school year goes from February to December, or sometimes late January to December. It's more a calendar year than anything else. Um, so we're about to start our summer holidays, which go for like six, seven weeks, just depending on your school. It has been, it's been very busy this year with the kids' school, particularly with Taylor finishing primary school. She's had a lot of like graduation stuff, like camp, um, and then we've had like, you know, final athletics carnivals with both kids at the school together. And yeah, you know, she's had final assemblies. It's just, it's, yeah, it's just been a bit of a whirlwind and so much fun. Yeah, so this is the last time that, the last couple of weeks that my kids will both be at the same school for the rest of their lives because they'll be going to different high schools. Both our kids will be going to single sex schools is the plan at this time. As long as Owen gets into the school that we, <laughs> we hope he does. Last few times that we're dropping them off at school together, because as of next year, you know, Taylor will be dropped off at a bus at a different time than we take Owen. Lots and lots of change coming up for our family. I've been working more this year than I have in like a long, long time. So that's been keeping me very, very busy. Oops. And then the kids as well have been doing a whole lot of after school sport more than they've ever done as well. Because now that Owen's in um, after school sports as well, it just adds an extra layer of busy but they're both enjoying both enjoying their sport they're both doing really well i was hoping that the postie was bringing me i had to order a new laptop battery so my laptop's really old i think it's from 2014 and when i uploaded well, when i was editing the what's in the christmas box video the other day it was an absolute struggle to even import the footage and i was working on it for about six hours honestly so hopefully um, a new battery solves the problem. It's not actually charging anymore. Like it's it's plugged into the power. So it's working through that, but the battery is at like 1% and not charging. So hopefully a new battery fixes it. And I was hoping that it was gonna come today so that this editing this video is not so difficult, but alas. So I've just come to pick up the kids from school. I took, I brought my little um, water bottle bag. I've carried it obviously from my front door to the car and I'm already in love with it. So good. <laughs> The kids have just reminded me that tomorrow is the advent calendar, or well, the first day of the advent calendar, so we're just popping them up now. Um, I just use, obviously, command hooks on the side of the fridge to hang our advent calendars. I used to have them, like, sitting out on the, the windowsill, but it just looked messy. Taylor wants to do the honours of hanging the advent calendars today. So, can you say hi? Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Look how tall she is now. Wait, stop. Look how tall. Ridiculous. Uh. <laughs> and they have promptly fallen <laughs> to the floor. So we're going to leave the hooks up a little bit longer and just let the stickers really, really stick on before we try and eat the calendars again. Taylor and I are off to her dress rehearsal in about an hour. 
So I spent some time earlier today getting all her costumes organized. She's not in as many numbers this year as she has been in previous years. So it was pretty, pretty easy to get together. And then we're not doing like, they don't have to wear their full makeup or anything for this dress rehearsal. So um, we just have to get her hair into a bun. She needs to wear her first costume for the run through, which is like a little school dress to music theater. So that's really easy. And then we've got to head to the venue. If you are a dance mum, I don't think I've shown this before. This is Taylor's, what are they call Dream Duffel, her dance bag. I basically emptied out like all the other costumes that we don't need for, for today. Uh, and then I have a different costume bag for each costume. And then I do this as well. So I just put on a hanger uh, the basic, basically the stuff that Taylor's in. So she knows where, what she has left to go. And then I do attach the full run sheet on the back of that as well. So she hangs that up on her rack with the costumes. They all hang and then she knows where she is in the show. End of year comps I find quite funny because all the comps that she goes to throughout the year, I'm always with her backstage. I help manage her costume changes and her hair and makeup and all of that. But with the concert, we're in the audience. So she's back there by herself. I think there's usually some helpers around, but she has to be a lot more independent. I do feel like she is capable. I mean, we've never had a drama before. I've organized it as best I can. So, I mean, Taylor has worn I think all she just hasn't worn the like Moana costume before but that one's really simple so she's worn all these before she knows how to sort of get herself organized she knows what accessories goes with what um the, the hair situation is going to be a bit tricky because during the comp season they've done like low plaits and low pigtails whereas for the comp uh, the concert we're doing like a low bun so that's a little bit different so hopefully she's able to get her costumes on and off without messing up the bun too much <laughs> But I'm going to get her to come and get ready and let's do this bun. She's got so much hair. So oh, it's going to be hard. Goes like in. Yeah. Stop talking like Stitch. Oh, wait, no. Are you video for the vlog? Yeah. <clears throat> no. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, hammer, mom, family, 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 family,